All right, here we are today checking out this beautiful old house built in 1815 to 1820. Really incredible place. The inside's just beautiful. Let's check it out. Look at how the house is built like four feet off the ground. Man. All right, here's the way inside. Look at that fireplace. Wow. That's really pretty. Big windows. Look at these huge windows. Looks like the original ceilings as well. Old hardware still on the doors. Let me show you this. It's an old enamel doorknob. Pretty door. I mean, that's an older door as well. Rosettes above the doorways. Look at the sliding doors. Very pretty. Oh, look, at the, it's even a custom lock too. That's really pretty. These doors would slide. Look at it. Wow, look at the interesting ceiling. I've never seen a ceiling like that. Then this fireplace is beautiful. Holy cow. That is gorgeous. This house is 200 years old. Look at the woodwork on that, that's incredible. Just imagine having to carve that. Man. Yeah, right? I've never seen a ceiling like that. It's really interesting. Love all these windows, all this natural light. Let me get my flashlight on. Wow, look at this knoll post. There we go. Oh, look at the hardwood floors. That's a fancy design right there. That is too cool. Wow. Still got some of the original wallpaper up on the ceiling. Man, this is the front door right here. Oh, this is cool. There's like a little uh, sitting room right here. Man, a lot of stuff. A lot of old stuff sitting around. Still the original shutters for the windows. Man, that is grand. Look at the designs, man, it's pretty. Let's keep going this way. There's a room here to the left. All right, let's keep moving. This house does not have a basement that I'm aware of. Oh, it's like built six feet off the ground. I'll show you the bottom side. Here's an old pull out mattress, not, nothing really there. Another pretty fireplace. Not quite as uh, ornate as the other one. Still pretty though, I mean, geez. Wow. So this was the kitchen of the house. That 
Now that's a little uh, backup servant staircase. Definitely gonna take the main staircase. Look at all this, I mean, there's a lot of trash left. Oh, they, so they closed that doorway up. Kitchen sink. Man, this is a pretty house. Okay, let's check out over to the left now. Man, this place is pretty. That's a new doorknob, an old door. I'm guessing that's the back door of the house. Probably leads to, I'll show you the back side of the house has this nice little back porch looking out to the woods, transom. A lot of clothes and stuff left. That's newer, probably 1920s, 1930s doorknob. Another pretty fireplace. Let me give you a close up. The door columns on the fireplace. Not Corinthian. Not like the other house I did in Georgia. Look at these. These are cool. What's this? One job. <laughs> Cleaning stuff. Where's Okay, let me show you this little closet right here. Pretty small closet. That's the room I started off in. Okay. Just did a little wrap around. Very cool. Keep on keeping on. Can't get over how pretty the staircase is. Just the designs. <laughs> Too cool. Did you see all that Catholic Lucilla? Yeah, what is that stuff? Oh, is that what it is? Is that like a local thing down here? I guess. I don't... He's from Columbia. Oh, South Carolina? No, like Columbia. Oh, Columbia. <laughs> I got my buddy Zane with me here today. You'll see him throughout the video. Hopefully not too much. <laughs> You're fine. Man, that's ornate. Look at the woodwork. Much more light up here. Go left first, and we'll just do a little wrap around. This is a pretty big house. Man. All the fireplace in this house are just beautiful. Look at the window. It looks like, I'm not sure. This is pretty. Looking out to the town. 
This house would have been something in its heyday. I mean, it's still something now, honestly. It's absolutely beautiful. I really hope this place gets restored. I'll include as much history as I can on this house, but I don't wanna give away a location. Very pretty. A little more simple fireplace than the other ones, but still nice wood carving. Very pretty. Nice little uh, closet right beside it. I love all the windows in this house. Man, so much natural light you have. That is, uh, doesn't even lead anywhere. It's just a little add-on. Who knows, this could have been a little porch back in the day. Too pretty. Hmm. Sorry, my hand's shaking a little bit. It's kind of cold this morning. Surprising for uh, Georgia. Let's keep going right. Should be three rooms left. That's weird. There's a laptop sitting here. Doesn't even look that old either. Okay, let's check out this room. I think almost every room in this house has a fireplace. Yeah, just about every single room in this house. Really cool. I could have sworn there was a servant staircase in the kitchen. It's gotta be, it leads up right here. What is this, a doorway to nowhere? <laughs> like a two two or three story drop right there i don't know why they would build that oh uh, this is where the servant staircase would lead up from the kitchen i didn't even have to walk up it yuck definitely not an original bathroom i don't know what's in those oh that's cool sink built into the wall there very pretty. Wrapped around. Okay, here's the very final room. Very pretty. Ah, I thought it was gonna be the first room to not have a fireplace, but nope. I really like that about these old houses. Every fireplace is built kind of differently. At least, I mean, this house you can tell was definitely something in its heyday. It's still something now. I mean, just not as good condition as it used to be. It's just beside that fireplace. I don't know if I want to walk up there. I'll give you a look at it from right here, but you can see the what it's built with and stuff. That is a very narrow staircase. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm gonna try that. The giant windows, six by six over, or six over six window panes. Mud dauber nest. man I think that's the whole house let me see if I can find like a date or something so I can show you when this place was last lived in here we go October 15th 2013 so it's maybe been empty seven or eight years the squatter could have brought these in huh People always ask me to look for expiration dates, so there's that. And if I can find a newspaper, I'll show you that as well. And it 
people want me to do a close up of the wallpaper. You can get this right here too. Look at the wallpaper, that's cool. The floor pad, it's not too bright though, it's like bright enough. I see stuff on the ground. Definitely digging the floor. Hmm. I don't know if there's anything else I can show you. I'll show you the basement or the underside part, but. Yeah, there's a basement. Was there? There's stairs under the house. They led into like a little underground park. But I, don't, I haven't seen any doorways. Have you? They go down no, there? No, yeah, it's so. Probably just like we gotta a, go out here. Yeah. Like I doubt there would have been a hot water heater when this place was first built. Yeah. Been, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Well, Look at this handle for the sliding door. Now close it. <laughs> That's pretty cool. This is cool. Old 50 caliber ammo box. <laughs> no 50 calibers in it anymore. Just a toolbox now. Treasures of. That's cool. Cool book. I didn't even notice this. Look at the built-in shelves. This is in the very first room I checked out. It's a mannequin in the cab. Oh wait, is this a? Oh, it's like a pulley system for you can uh, you could bring the send the food up. I'm pretty sure. I'm almost positive that's what that is. It's a dumb waiter. A dumb waiter. That's what it's called. Thank you. It's a map on the wallpaper too. Oh, oh the. Bro, that's dope. All now you see that where the house is built six feet off the ground that's a, that's a tall... i'd show you that part but it's pretty filled up with water the brick foundation really pretty i guess it's an above ground basement technically Look at the beams the house was built with. Support for the fireplace. It's pretty flooded. What a cool place. I'm really glad I was able to film this house. This is the back porch of the house. Back porch is kind of falling in now, but just wanted to show you the back view. Nice view. Always nice having woods behind your house.